Welcome back, Streltsies. My name is Mr. Craven. This is some more European Rosales for Third Rome. Playing as Russia. There it is. That's the map what we need. And yeah, it's going really well. I'm still wondering how to deal with the freaking East. To be fair. Because any war I declare. Go now! <laughs> I don't even care. Go in right away. They have lesser military power. Ming will not defend them. They're Protestant of all things. Bloody hell. Well, that was a good timing, actually. <laughs> Looking at them and like, yeah, we should maybe, whenever we can, go to war with them. And then all of a sudden, we can go to war with them. I should send in a second army just in case. Because they, numbers wise, yeah. oh, right, Vassal Swarm. They will deal with it eventually. They do want me to build up a proper fleet. 75% of force limit we have. We don't need that many ships though. 10 would be plenty. Right, because the 26, uh, 26 out of 34 is indeed more than what we need. Just do this. Um, right. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. That should be sufficient. So you don't have to go to home this war per se. We already have control of Udi. I will take the admin tech at least. It's only 9% over. Gets us some production efficiency, which means more money. I just, I need to wait for the diplo tech to come in before I can take the military tech, sadly. Mio Gassan. One of the biggest Boreatias I have seen, at least. Hello, army. Let's go back for you. I mean, we have better general. Actually, we lost more than they did, surprisingly. Ignore them. They have a fort here somewhere. And there it is, the Age of Absolutism. Caring. Ah, hello, you've arrived. Perfect. Okay, so the Age of Absolutism. We already have a potential for a large army. Perfect. Um, we do not have any universities. That's the next admin tech level. We do not have any trade companies. We need 90 absolutism, which is a lot. Five cultures. That is probably possible. And a religious league war never even happened. Hey, wait a minute. I don't think they count. A different promoted culture, yeah. We need to spend 500 Diplo on getting that. Which will eventually be doable. It's not their fort. Kuros zone of control. I'm assuming it's this one because it unseeged that too. Yeah, it is actually Kuro. Oh, hi, army. On the siege of Chara. Hmm. 
Mm, perfect. The Conquest of Siberia. Perfect timing for that one to pop up. Um, why don't you also go protect trade in Novgorod? Maybe we can keep more money back here. Um, Riev, yes. This conversion started ASAP. This was the perfect timing that Ming didn't des decided not to join in on it. Silesia has a civil war after their punitive. Uh, wow, they didn't even. It's still actually going though. One true faith. Polish separatists, Lithuanian separatists, Estonians. They're the Polish ones already. Well, good thing for us. We have enough military power to get another general. Lundwir, missionary. X guy. But Lassie was one. So you can have that guy. It's Epiphany. His name is Epiphany. That is a very interesting name, to be fair. My 46. It's the annexation that's almost done, though. One more year. Is there? No, this is all bordered by someone else. Kuru was sieged. I know this area from the Manchu campaign, I just don't know where the hell I am at the moment. I'm just taking as much as we can. Question is, are we getting more and more objectives now? It's just those provinces. Go Kiva, take Bargosin, there we go. And Bargosin is a gold province. Oh, hello, look here. Randomly Karakionlu getting me stuff, you know, just randomly. I'm gonna try and eat as much as I can over here. Uh, no, thank you. No, 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 no. I'm not done with you yet. Uriyev has been converted. We're almost done. We, we're almost done with our religious ideas. Uh, but then again, we'll soon have Tengri people here to convert. I have no idea yet. But... Oh, and now they rise up in revolt? That's not even that big of a group. Ulch. That is C, so I need to go here. Warrat have claimed Irkutsk. I just have 50,000 men running through Siberia, randomly finding an army over there, too. That's nice of them. They are sieging, which is helping. I just can't see what they're sieging until it's sieged. Oh, that's... Oh, Georgia. No, no, no. Go away, Briatia. I'm taking more. I want to try and get all the way to Vladivostok if I can. I mean, it's... Our real marriage ended with our... Uh... Currently being integrated vassal, which is almost done, finally. You see them sieging stuff, or starting the sieges, but you don't see it finish yet. Darren. There we go, integrated Galicia, Fulhinia. And of course they love me over here. Um, nobles. Definitely not reforming society. Soroka. Question is, how big is it? It is probably one to one. I will give them more authority. I could actually do that and almost get rid of all that autonomy already. Okay, um, we need to send at least a diplomat to the vassals now, or subjects. That's the outraged as well for now. 
First thing he's doing is topping off with Georgia. Hey, I'm helping you deal with your own rebels and Jiren. Go away. Jiren under our control. Um, where's Korea? Whoa! Oh, rebels, peasants. Um, let's call them publicly. Oh, that's Flahinia's army. Right, I got control of that one. It's true. Converted something else. Only a few left. Yeah, I'm gonna take care of these peasants because it's their capital of all places. I mean, kind of do need to control it. Oh, they actually ran out. Oh, I definitely need to keep that because it's another fort. And the last conversion is starting now. And then we have to wait until 48 to convert the other two. I have to deal with my friends, rebels, right now. Oh, crap. We just get out. Austria declared war on Hungary. Hungary exists in Istria. Oh. And of course, Spain is getting wrecked by France again. I think this is their last one over here. And... Which region is this officially? Manchuria? And this is Ningputa. I would actually have to look at a map to see um, what area I need to take for Russia. Uh, Teutonic or we are captain military power. We have maximum legitimacy, so we don't need to strengthen the government right now. But what I can do is take this tech, which allows me to take this tech without the issues of having to go uh, corruption problematic again. Actually, I can now take this one too. Get ahead of time, and the unbalanced research is balanced out. Means I cannot take more tech, obviously, right now. Let's upgrade the cannons. Um, maps. I'm just checking my phone for the map. Okay, yeah. Yeah, it's Ferdin. Ferdin is the furthest province. Then it goes. This line, this line. Just up here by Hingen, yeah. This one, it goes down. Onangol is actually part of, uh. Yeah, okay. So we need Onangol, and then Hingen. I'm try just trying to recreate some the original borders or the, the current borders I should say yeah and they're quite easily marked on the map as well so let's talk with Buryatia 
this is what we definitely need to take. Then this. Oh, we cannot take it all in one war. We're getting close. Only Buryatia cares. Not even Ming cares. At all. Sakhalin because, well, it's Sakhalin. Nah, I'm not taking Sakhalin. They are willing to give this up. I do need, kind of need Ferdin. Okay, hang on. Let's see. I want Ferdin. I'm trying to make my way over there. It looks ridiculous, but I can always go in for a second time. But I do need Gara for the mission. If I do this, 101 aggressive expansion, Oirat will care. 90.9 over extension. Yeah, I'll take it. Ferdan, yep. It looks super messy, but also quite hilarious. And we have... Uh, not yet the board. That is. This looks more like Korea, yeah. Seems as if Korea is at war with Ming right now. Pirate is at war with Ming right now. Hmm. Yep, core costs. Oh, almost all of them. Finding power of the boyars. Another conversion. Um, let's actually start one of the conversions now. Core it a little bit later. Conquer Vasterboten. I don't want that. Increase relationship with uh, Norway. That is interesting. Is Norway is independent? That is also impressive. And Denmark took a bite out of Sweden at some point again. This crooked Charlot discontent. Are you kidding me? Plus two for discontent. That means time of troubles will advance. And the annoying, really annoying part is overextension doesn't actually stop that. At least that is good. That is really good. We're suddenly really close to doing this. Oh no, the Lithuanian separatists and Trick Guy that have a army there already waiting for them. Now this content is really, really, really bad. Oh, I lost someone here. Let's get... Actually, we do have... Mm, no. I'll get the tax guy. Yeah, rooting out corruption is currently, again, really expensive. But that just has to last until the cores are finished. Fatima, our new queen. Fatima Yusuf from Karakiyunlu. She's not doing bad. Actually, what I'm... I put my phone away when I was checking what lands. So, all we need now are... Hang on. Yeah, Urkan, Hingan, Highland Boo. And... This back here. Whoa, what now? We've got a Coptic Lvov. Well, we're converting it away immediately. Oh, and Pigeon already converted. That was really fast. It's already orthodox. It's, um, yeah. 
I would like to thank you all for watching. Make sure to like this video if you enjoyed it and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep up to date in the future. <sighs> I'll see you guys later.